I think uh, with a clear passage, she might get over the top of them closer to rain, but she will need a bit of luck. She gets back early. Spring Agatha, another one that doesn't always begin brilliantly, but drawn the pink. So it's a race that uh, anything could happen here. Green lights on, set to go. Ready. Racing, closer to rain, last to leave. Good speed, Charlie's Misty will have no trouble leading. Sutton Sandy's over to second. And that front pair get away by a length there. The Dakota Roxy third. They jam up front. Deep out on the Tequila's going forward. In between runners, Dark Tides. A gap then to Redeemer Prize. Spring Agatha. And last of all here is closer to rain. But look at on the Tequila. It's uh, going right around the outside. Takes on Charlie's Misty. Spring Agatha's got into the clear running on late. It's flying home at the leader. But uh, hanging on on the Tequila. I think from Spring Agatha who charged home. Charlie's Misty third. Dakota Roxy close up with also Sutton Sandy. Photo fourth, fifth. Closer to rain, never a chance. Redeemer prize, dark tides. Photo, but seven will get in. On the tequila, hangs on. Spring Agatha diving through late. Has just missed, and Charlie's Misty runs third ahead of six Sutton Sandy at seven, eight, four, and six. Seven, eight, four, and six on the tequila. Robin McKellar tanks it out. It's ahead by a length and a quarter. Eight Spring Agatha second, one more bound, and she would have got up for sure. And four Charlie's Misty has snuck into third ahead of Sutton Sandy. And the favourite closer to Rain was always well back, and you never ever wanted to be on her. Seven, eight, four, and six after race eight. 30 and 59 the time. 5.24 early, 14.52, 17.78, 12.81 the sectionals. It's ahead by a length and a quarter, seven, eight, four, and six after race eight.